Hey guys, real quick video about where your hands should be when you're riding western, riding one hand. Um, I've learned from my mentor many years ago that you stay in the box about halfway up the, the mane or the neck, 8 to 10 inches in front of the horn. So when you're riding, you're asking, you go this way, 8 to 10 inches, or this way, 8 to 10 inches. But it teaches you to stay in front of the horn. Because you're going to get a, if, if you're back here, you're, oh, go on like this. You're going to get a different response than this, in front of the horn. Okay, he's collected, he's soft. Boy, back here, where's his head? Where's his head? Okay, he doesn't, he doesn't deserve that. And it doesn't look good. When you're riding your ranch riding pattern, ladies, or any kind of Western performance or even trail riding, teach, your, teach yourself, I got a good exercise. See this rubber band? Two? Okay. We're going to do this. You ride like this. I'm going to ride two hands. You ride like this for a while. Okay. I can't. <laughs> I can't overextend my, my hands. Pretty soon, you're going to teach yourself to stay right here in the box. This was done on me. Okay. See, it's even hard. Okay, it's hard. This was done on me by, by my trainer. Put a rubber band so I can't flop my hands around. I can't move. My hands stay quiet. Teach them to stay right here in the box in front of the horn and pretty soon anything back here is going to feel going to feel off it's going to feel weird you, you cannot force a horse besides it doesn't look good so the proper way to ride a horse is stay in the box okay all your maneuvers should be that refined if they're not then you're going to teach with two hands. Okay, stay in the box. Until next time, give Cody a thumbs up. He's my superstar. And uh, subscribe to our channel. Anything you want to see, let me know in the comments. Until next time, ride well.